I mean, I think another element in there which is really as essential to it all is the concept of society. I mean, because the concept of society has a big impact on your concept of other societies. And <clears throat> the, 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 the whole Westphalian, European idea of the nation state, which is a crock, but I mean, it was, it was uh, and it comes out of the Enlightenment and out of rationality, was this idea that nation states were single races with single religions and single mythologies, and, you know, monolithic. Uh, and, you know, so they spent 400 years killing the minorities and eliminating them. I mean, the Holocaust was just sort of the last step in 400 years of, of murder and def uh, banning of languages and all sorts of stuff, and inventing of mythologies, you know, uh, for people who didn't belong in the mythologies but were forced to. So th the, the really interesting thing about that is that, that what they missed was, so they were so determined to create the idea that a nation of people really are together because they're the same. It was the opposite of difference. It's why today they're so uncomfortable in Europe with the whole concept of, of, of difference inside their society because they spent a half a millennium developing nation states which are about sameness, not difference, right? But because of that obsession with we the French people, we the German people, we the English people, the island race, all that crap, um, what that uh, uh, means is that you have no way of accepting difference, but it also contains within it the idea that because we are, fill in the blank, all the same, we like each other. We're the same and therefore we like each other. We're a family together. Well, the reality of society is that, A, you've never met most of the people. I mean, how many, I, mean I know more, more people than most. How many people do I know? You know, a couple of thousand? I don't know what I know. I mean, suppose I knew 10,000 people uh, out of 34 million. You know, I mean, I don't even know them really, right? And, and then how many people do you actually love? Well, that's probably three or four max, and that's a push. Uh, how many are you friends with? Uh, so really, uh, peace, living peace, is accepting the idea that you're going to live with people you don't know, and pr more important, you're going to live with a lot of people you probably don't like, and you don't have anything in common with. And that idea that society is made up of people who don't know each other and don't like each other, but live together peaceably, not because they're ordered to, not because of the law, but because that's what people do. They live together in difference. That's peace. 